Hi, welcome to the channel. My name is Erica Lucas. In this video, I'm going to take you on a tour of our small minimalist dining room. It's finished. It's the first room that's actually unpacked, decorated, and feels done. <laughs> it's a very popular room in our house. We play games. We do some school in here sometimes. We have our meals, our snacks, everything kind of flows through this room. Heading to the right, we have our cedar chest. This is a cedar chest that was gifted to us from my grandmother. It is beautiful. I am so glad that we hung on to it over the years. It's empty. It's not holding anything for us right now. but I felt like it really completed the room in here with the table. And then on top, I have a flat box with games that all three of my kids can play. So when they're looking for something to do, they can come in here and look in the box, find a game and play together. I also just have this decoration and then our menu for the week. I like a farmhouse style look. So that's where I went with in this dining room uh, with this cookbook holder that I'm using as a menu holder. Over on the wall to the left are farmhouse-like shelves with the black metal or iron and the wood. Um, and I've just sparsely decorated them with a couple of things that are my favorites. I'm still trying to find my Ray Dunn box. We haven't unpacked everything. And there are some a couple of Ray Dunn pieces that I have in mind for these shelves and I can't find them. So we just gotta unpack the rest of the boxes to be able to finish what I want here. And then this cart matches the shelves on the wall with the black metal and then the wood shelves. And then I have matching flap boxes here. The bottom flap box has games, more games that everybody can play. And then in the middle is just a decoration that pulls in the greens and the creams and the whites. And then the top box I have our napkins because the kids are mostly charged with setting the table. And so they get the napkins from in here. And then we have an ottoman that we used to have in our old house. We brought it here. My mom had recovered it to match the curtains that we have in here. And so we just pull this for extra seating on the end when we have company over. This table is called a farmhouse table. It's made of soft pine and then stained dark. The table itself is eight feet long and the two benches are six foot benches that are designed to slide underneath. I like to pull them halfway out. Um, I just think it looks better. Plus we use this table so much, like <laughs> there's no sense in pushing in the benches. <laughs> And then over on the opposite wall that leads into the kitchen, not sure if I need something here or not. I'm waiting to unpack maybe, a, you know, a set of pictures that might go here. I'm not shopping for anything in particular. I may leave the wall blank. Uh, it's to be determined. If I find something as we're unpacking that would go really well in here, I may flank the opening into the kitchen with them. But for now, they're, they're the blank walls. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think this wall here needs something on it, like pictures, something, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, I, I kind of like it the way it is. Let me know what you think. We just, we do so many things in here. So um, I hope you enjoy this tour and here's a link to the latest video.